Hello everyone, I am gonna focus my conversation today on TV advertisement. Um, so in the United States, there are 331.9 million of people. And I was wondering, how many people in the United States have cable? Well, I found this graphic uh, with the 10 leading cable providers, and it shows that just 21% of the population have cable. Also, the graphic is showing us that every year, the number of subscribers decrease. Why do people have cable? What is the reason? Okay, well, it looks like the main reason is to watch sports and the last reason is to follow political events. The other reasons that are listed and on this graphic are interesting because are related with internet speed, because they have travel broadcasting, they have cable because it came with a combo like cable, phone, uh, internet. So that's why they have it, just because. But who watch TV in the United States? Who watch cable TV? All the generations tend to use more cable TV and younger generations prefer the streaming. As we can see, baby boomers are the ones that consume TV more than three hours per day. And on the other side, Gen Z are the ones who consume more streaming. To have an idea, I was looking um, for how much time are we exposed uh, to ads when we watch TV cable, and I found that the average is between 14 and 17 minutes per prime time hour. And the categories that usually advertise are food, uh, cars, insurance. I can uh, recall that usually it's like food chains, McDonald's, uh, Burger King, Wendy's, Taco Bell, and cars, the last Honda, the new Toyota. I also see car insurance like the famous Geico. Um, does it work for me? The That kind of advertisement? I don't think so. Um, so when I'm exposed to that kind of marketing, I is usually on Hulu uh, because I have this subscription that is bound with my phone. So it has advertisement on it. Uh, it's like 30 seconds of our advertisement. And when that happened, I usually go to the bathroom. I check my phone. I go for a snack, everything, but to watch the advertisement. Um, also, if I'm looking for food, I don't remember the commercial that I watched that day or the, the day before or that week. I take my phone use my GPS and see a location nearby that has food. Usually big brands are the ones that use um, TV advertisement, big companies, but also these companies don't rely only on TV advertisement. They usually have 360 campaigns. Um, maybe they use TV advertisement for awareness, for um, like to stay relevant, for example. I know that TV is great for showcasing. For example, the cars, new brand cars, they're always showcasing those cars. So this car has its future, somebody's driving the car, showing all the technology that it has. Or when a restaurant has a new menu, they show the menu, they show the price, they show someone enjoying the meal. Um, so it could be good for for showcasing maybe. Uh, and that's probably the reason they still rely on that kind of advertisement. Also because since these uh, companies have like a wide target, uh, like food, McDonald's, it's for everyone, even, they even have kid menu. Um, car insurance, well, anyone who has a car did sucker insurance and in the United States you are able to drive uh, after you're 18 years old so yeah maybe they want to get a wider target this is a good opportunity for reach to reach a wide uh, target or with the case that I was uh, talking about like the car insurance gecko I've never even gone to their website to look for anything 
um, when I got my current insurance, it was like um, for a recommendation of, some, of someone that I trust. And usually if I need something and I don't know about the topic, I yeah, ask, for a, ask to a friend for a, an advice or Google search. But I never rely on commercials, honestly. As the author of the book, uh, Sweezy states, um, it's not effective. Um, it's not, it doesn't show up when you need it. Well, maybe, yeah, it could be a coincidence, but one out of how many people? Five, 100, 200, 500, I don't know. Um, so it's not relevant for the moment. Um, I feel bothered by it. Um, so I don't think I agree with the author of the book uh, that mass marketing doesn't work. And that, that is it. Thank you for listening. Have a good night.